Dzień dobry, witam Państwa bardzo serdecznie. Dzisiaj w naszym studiu koncertowym forum wyjątkowy gość. Paulis Anderson, litewsko-duńskie pianista, wieloletni uczestnik forum, zdobywca Złotego Parnasa, a w tym roku artysta, który swoim wystąpieniem otworzył Międzynarodowe Forum Pianistyczne. You are a young pianist and you have came a long and probably not really an easy way to, uh, to be in the place you are now. And my question is, what do you have to do to become recognizable in pianist world? From the point of professional part, so I would say, first of all, you need to practice hard and obviously it's talent. So it's a mixture of being talented and working hard. And those are, I think those are the main components. Obviously, you need to be, you need to know how to present yourself, how to talk to people, how to communicate, how do you even nowadays with social media and everything. So I think that's also very important how you work on social media, okay. how you ad advertise yourself and many other things. So I think it's a combination of many factors, but of course, just from the point of a profession, I would say talent and hard work. That's the first thing. Okay, so like pianistic skills aren't really enough to become a recognizable pianist. But how do you learn to uh, do the, all those things that you have mentioned? Where any pianist that you will meet, uh, what will you advise to them? Where should they like look for knowledge? Uh, I think first of all we need to look at just just from my experience, I just looked at other pianists, at other successful pianists uh, from the social uh, social media uh, point of view, and also like not only successful in playing part, but also like that they are recognized internationally musicians but so I just try I look at them and I see what they do and also meeting good people meeting people who wants to help you that's also very important and I was very lucky that I had great teachers I had great people and I met, met so many great people that actually were willing to help me so 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 I think this is also part of the thing is you need to always find for people, search for people to work with. You need to be very social as a person. You need to work on your social skills. Um, how do you talk to people? How you dress? How you behave? It's just the other part of uh, being successful, not only in playing part. You come here <laughs> every year, almost. Yeah, every year. Uh, yes, almost. I. I think I skipped only one year, that was last year, yeah. but other than that, I, I came here since 2011, wow. uh, since 2010. Wow, that, that's yeah. really, really long time. Why do you do this and what role in your career, uh, what role played like Międzynarodowe Forum Pianistyczne and Złoty uh, Parnas you've won? So I can, I can tell you a small story. Okay, How it I will. <laughs> started. So I was a teenager. I was 14 years old. This was in 2009. I won a small competition in Lithuania and I got the prize to go here. And I was looking Sanok and I was looking at the map. So I was like, "Oh my god, this is so far away." So, but yeah, I should go here. I had I had no idea about this piano piano form. I had no I had nothing. I didn't know anything. And my mother was uh, accompanying me. To, and she was of course good mother so she said like listen let's go because this is your prize you want so you should go here and I came here and I could see oh my god like so many good musicians so many famous pianists like here I was so surprised that it's such a prestigious festival and then next year uh, I was invited to play at least uh, Tottenham's with orchestra and uh, after and then I won a golden partners Lotic partners mm. and so this festival it has very big it had very big impact on my career because 
uh, after I won Golden Parnas here, I played in, uh, in Slovakia, I played in many, many, many places in Poland, and I still do. I played in, in Belarus even, and, and I met many important people that helped me with my career, and I also met many people, like many great teachers, many interesting personalities. That that had very big influence on my playing, and I, and also I met very good friends here, Aww. and I have many friends that I have met. I know many people here that I've I met them like first or second time I came here. They became close friends of mine, and we still talk and we still meet sometimes. They fly to Lithuania or I fly to them, and we play together and 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 and, and so on. Wow, it's it's even a romantic story, yeah. early. And I have like one more question. Uh, how does it feel to come here now as an artist and play an opening concert? I was a little bit surprised. I could not believe one uh, one Yaroslav Javetsky called me. It's like, hey, can you play? I was like, oh my god, in front of all these people, in front of the most renowned. Piano professors and musicians, I feel honored. I think it's a big honor to play here for me. And especially after so many years that I've been here. And I used to be I used to be in the audience and I would attend the concerts of superstars and famous musicians. And now I'm one of them that plays in the opening uh, uh, in the opening concert. Wow, that, that's really great. So that's all of my questions. Thank you very much and I and I think all of uh, all of the listeners, we congratulate you so much because you've came a long way uh, and a difficult way, and it's it's really something admirable. So that's all for it. Thank you very much. I thank you also państwu bardzo bardzo serdecznie za wysłuchanie nas, za to, że byliście z nami, i do zobaczenia już jutro na kolejnym studiu koncertowym forum.